We're excited to be on the road to our biggest trip of this year <laughs> with more machines than we ever put on a trailer before. Now we're heading to one of the most historical trail systems I've read about. We're gonna be there for 11 days straight, making it one of the longest trips yet. being over 15 hours away it'll be the longest drive we've taken topping our South Carolina trip by a few hours what do you think about that camera um, South Carolina. <laughs> Going to somewhere else. They don't know yet. to the Hatfield and McCoy trail system. Our plan is to stop at some of the most historical and unique spots that this trail system has to offer. driving through Kentucky. Man, it's a different way of life. <laughs> this is a different way of life. Very unique, beautiful countryside. I didn't realize how beautiful it was with the mountains and everything being so green. So, good job, Kentucky. Beautiful place to live. Where do you think, Jana? It's amazing and it's very scary to drive sometimes. <laughs> I like to tell you when to stop. <laughs> She's not lying. Just look. Golly. Those houses up there. It's huge. Mountains are driving through. Yeah. <laughs> 
They, uh, the, uh, camper wouldn't be able to go. How far? How far good? to where we'll be staying at for the next 12 days. Now, the way into Gilbert that we took, we had to stop in Kentucky for something. We came from Lexington to Gilbert. If you're jumping on Highway 52 to hit 65 to get into Gilbert, and you got a big camper, our normal camper that's over 13.4 tall would not be able to fit underneath the bridge at Williamson. And then the road, Highway 52, is its own challenging. I've never seen a road go from this to this while making a curve and you feel it when you're on the side of that mountain. So just beware, here's your warning. If you're coming from Lexington to Kentucky side and need to take Highway 52 to get into Gilbert, that you better be prepared. Your truck better be able to handle the steep inclines and declines uh, of that terrain. So. All right, warning's over with. We just arrived. We're excited about getting inside. Let's go check out where we'll be staying at for the next 12 days. Oh, oh, oh step in a mess, you all right? Yes, I am okay. Right. We're gonna check out where we'll be staying at. Hey, oh my God, this is so cool. What's in here? Two bathrooms, kitchen, bedroom. It's pretty cool. I got it on this one. I got it on this one. Where's my chair? Yeah, you got a kitchen. They got an office for you over here too, baby. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's another secret room that we get to go enjoy. So let's go check it out. Who's coming? I do you do the 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 secret room. Room. It's that room that was like every New Yorker. It was like every New Yorker. Every New Yorker? Yeah. Nope, not that door. That door? Nope, not that door. Nope. That door. Nope, y'all wait, y'all wait. Y'all wait. Turn on the light. Excited? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. We got air hockey, pool, two pool tables. We got ping pong. We got basketball. Every night we're gonna be chilling here, huh? We got foosball. We got a big kitchen. That's a, that's a small TV, huh, Kay? That's a big TV. <laughs> yeah, both families have been here, yeah. It's a big old dinner table we can eat at at nighttime. What you think? We're going to start unloading, get back with you.
that escalated quickly. I am soaking wet. I'm the one who's dry. She is dry, at least. All right. Y'all can already know our other, we got two machines just in a dangerous situation when it's wet. So let's see if you can see them. Got one on top of the box. We added this one on top of the back of my toolbox. So, and both that one and this one has to go in the road to get off. Mine does. My buddy does, and my sister, so he's gonna do yeah. that one. So, we're gonna let, hopefully it lightens up some and then get back out there. I don't mind taking a risk, but hopefully it's not raining very long. It's coming down hard though right now. All right, the rain has let up enough. I almost come to complete stop, so we're actually gonna go out there and try to finish unloading right now before it comes back, so. Wish us luck. <laughs> the tarantula in my door. A tarantula? Something like that. Get your shoe and smish it. Short on the them. wrong day. <laughs> it's a different kind of show. Exactly. I thought I emailed you black shirts today. <laughs> that was a lot safer than I thought. <laughs> we got Doug and his family here now. Mr. Tyler. Boom. Here are the boys walking. Check out the, the hangout room. Yeah. Oh, you want to check out the bedrooms first? No, go in here first. All right. They haven't had a chance to see it like we have. They don't know yet, this is our parking spot and they can park out in the weather. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. I wasn't That's happy crazy. when we got on that. I was not happy. You have one right? This is awesome. We're gonna fit all our machines in here. I read about the garage and I'm like, I wonder how big it is because in the picture it cuts it off there. Uh, so I'm like, well, is it just one row? Yeah. There she is. Yeah. All time no see. I know, right? I'm soaking you wind. Are. <laughs> <laughs> she came in hot. <laughs> we went like an hour and a half without any rain. I'm like, oh, it's going to be dry. Yeah. We'll be able to get in the machine and not be soaking wet. And like the last 15 minutes, I couldn't see. Yeah. All right, Doug and his boys are unloading. Let's go see how they're doing out here. You unloaded, bud? Stop. Me and Lucas got ours unloaded. You got y'all's unloaded? These are little toolboxes. Those aren't little toolboxes. That's, that's fancy waterproof stuff. Oh, yeah. This even still a code in. Yeah. Because of the four holes we had to drill in to make it work. Yeah. I was about to show me where he's in, in his fancy toolbox. Oh, yeah. Holy smokes. Um, we got a flathead screwdriver. Oh, those are that's useful. Your, that's your Ch chain putter back on her. Chain putter back on her? <laughs> and then we got a Phillips, because why not? 
Because why not? That's right. You got him the same thing in both of them? Yeah. That's awesome. He had to fix his sister pin or whatever to put the bolt on. He just popped the thing up, got rid of it. And then we got a wrench there. Got some zip ties. They got some shackles in here for towing. Got that big toe strap, got some pliers, got some needle nose. And then I also put this on my feet. Hey, you do like the water. That made sense right there. Get something that will float. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> he bought it. Yeah. Was it hard to install right here? No. It took longer to get the pieces on and put them back on and it didn't take it to put the whole thing up. Well, if you have a big crew like us, now you know if everything can fit in here. We got two four-seaters, a pro R, two two hunters, and we have three fours. I bet you we could even get it tighter and fit more machines than if you had a really big put another one of these in there. Oh yeah. Look for the four wheels on the side over there. You gotta do put four feet Pro, if you like to get a touch of pro arm, you gotta keep your hands on that. Get the bubble rod on the Alright, stay tuned to watch our journey unfold over the next few days. Uh, this is a place you think you want to come enjoy. Check out the description of this video for links to free GVX files of routes that we're going to take and places we're going to stop. Please show your support by hitting the subscribe button and clicking the bell icon to turn on notifications. <laughs> if you've enjoyed this video here, please smash the like button and thank you for watching.